all them right in. Now I have to reload. Apologies for my delay, YouTube. Uh, it's December 9th, and I have no camera. I have an iPhone that is fully full of stuff and it's probably gonna cut out any second but I'm going in the woods and I'm gonna try and delete some of the stuff so I can get this deer on film. I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay we deleted some stuff. We're back in business. It's December 9th. Um, had some snow down here in southern Maine for a week or so now and I'm finally getting on it so there's cracks everywhere. Um, we're gonna see if we make heads or tails of this and it's uh Smoke stick season. So here we go, guys. Missed ya. With wee cold snow. I'm not trying to look for any fresh tracks or anything like that because it's really hard to tell the age of the tracks right now. They're all kind of hard. And I know if I jump on, it's going to be soft on the inside. So I just want to be in the vicinity of tracks. And then when I jump the deer because this is pretty thick woods I'll be able to know where they're going so that's kind of my game plan and I'm just gonna walk nice and easy and walk up to them and shoot them like I always do and uh not gonna be picky on a buck today so whatever the Lord gives me I shall take it <laughs> so we got some rubs which is a great thing. Nice little area right here. So we're just going to take it easy. I'm not going to call too much. Because uh, it's the end of the season. And I just want to poke a little. Yep, nothing to do all day. But shoot deer. Everybody calls it still hunting. And that's kind of the method I'm using right now. I'm just... It's kind of crunchy-ish walking, but it's no wind, no nothing. I got a lot of ambient noise from the uh, Poland Springs factory right beside me. Um, but it's really not enough to do cover any of my noise. So I'm just making a little bit of noise, going nice and easy. Tip a can once in a while, and then that's about it. And just take it easy, five minutes, and then just go a little ways. When visibility kind of sucks and when it's nice and flat and the conditions are good for them to lay down is what I'm looking for because it's not really a good day today um, deer probably aren't going to be moving very much but if I can get them to kind of be curious about me that's kind of what I'm trying to do nothing really too exciting kind of inside the uh, bigger hardwoods and I'm getting to some thicker stuff a little more greenery and stuff this is where they've had a tendency to lay down so I'm walking like there's uh, a ball and chain hook or there's a chain hook between my legs and I'm just making it so I take little steps and then tip a can once in a while that way I don't have the same stride and I'm it sounds like I got might be more deer or whatever um just can't sound like a human that's what we're employing right now and still trying to find a fresher track have a whole bunch of old tracks but nothing that's really really nice and like yeah well, it's, it's right here not yet didn't take very long there's a deer right up here I'm not sure what it is Call them right in. Now I have to reload. I was going to wait a little longer, but it's there. I'll leave a little bit of mystery on the film. Okay, now that I'm all reloaded, let's go walk over the deer.
<laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to shoot it one more time. Beautiful little buck. Beautiful little buck. Okay. I'm gonna finish him off. Sorry, bud. I'm really sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm really sorry. <sighs> I wanted to go hunting so bad. And I missed everybody. Sorry that you couldn't be here with me. I'm sorry I wasn't there. But now I get to call you. And I get to wait for you to get here. So I have plenty of time to think. And then plenty of time to be grateful for this little buck. what it feels like inside and if you have to have a big one to make it feel that way it's okay and if a little one makes you feel that way it's okay as well it's all the same because one day I'm going to be there and I'm going to be where that deer is right there and it will be my time I'm going to check this There he is, guys. Set my camera up here in a little bit, and then we'll talk. Well, there you have it, guys. Boys are on their way. Let's not point that too much at me. Boys are on their way. Nice little buck. Uh, I'm not sure what to name him yet, so I'll have to do a little thinking. But uh, it works, guys. So came out here with the intention of shooting a deer, but was not looking for one. I just used my feet, and I just said, go where you need me to go, and was like along for the ride, basically. And that's how it's done. Easy little guy. I pretended to be a deer and I said I'm gonna pretend to be a deer so the deer can uh, walk up to me and here he is so it is that simple and you can do it with a big deer you can do it with a little deer it doesn't matter you just have to go out go out and I don't know just <laughs> be yourself and don't get caught up in the process just allow it to happen and let it flow yeah. I'm almost thinking about naming them flow <laughs> it's just no words can describe what it takes it's more of a feeling than anything and as you see all in the video I just went out there and I just pretended to be a deer I showed you exactly what we did and I used a tipper can I did one small grunt, which is why he took his time coming in. Um, and then, of course, I saw him as plain as day, but we'll have to have to check out on the computer if you can actually see him or whatever, but at least I got a shot on film. Come on. Yeah. Oh, well. But 
it's easy if you let it happen. It's hard if you try and make it happen. And if you're if you're down in the dumps, and I was pretty down in the dumps, I was really really wanting to go up to camp with everybody, but I was not supposed to go to camp apparently. I was supposed to I was supposed to come get him. And I'm happy. It's a great, great little buck, and it's probably the, the biggest rack buck we got this year. It's pretty good. <laughs> uh, Rodney's going to be proud. Yep. And now we're, I think he's, we're three. Every boy got one, and I don't think he got one this year so far, so. Yeah. So, they're on their way. At least Taylor and Tracy are coming, and we'll uh, relive the story. Good morning, everybody. It's been a minute since the last entry. Um, it is Saturday, uh, the last Saturday in muzzleloader season. I got a sled in case he shot a buck. We're pretty excited. He just walked out back behind his house. Pow! So we're gonna go recover this thing, and we got a sled here that's a little uh, a little worse for wear, but uh, shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> Not too bad for snow. We got a little bit here. And uh, we brought in reinforcements. I got some help with me. Tracy's going to help me go recover this buck. It's only 0.6, so it's not real far. But we're going to see what Casey's got. Not even wearing full beagles today. Nice. If that's a, uh, a good sign. Maybe uh, maybe Casey's buck's got some horns on its head. There's all kinds of rubs in it. I just haven't seen any big tracks. They've all been kind of small. But we're only about a quarter mile to go. Easy drag, easy drag. How are we doing, bud? <laughs> I see him. Another swamp, shooting him down the swamp. There he is. Right there. Oh, got a tag out. Nice. Not a bad drag out of here, I don't think. Nah, it'd be pretty easy. There's a road right up there. Yeah, they make their their racks aren't too bad. Oh, whoa! <laughs> whoa! <laughs> hey, look at the wow! Wow, Casey, on a deer that big, they make look at they the make antlers they, they make antlers down here. Holy! And you got it all on film. Yeah, you can't can't you can see Dude, it a little bit. Look at the bone on that thing. <laughs> what? That doesn't <laughs> even make sense. Holy cow! That's a that is a racker, dude. Yeah, Pick that up. Not that that's a racker. Look at the bone on that thing. On a deer that big, I'm looking at the tracks coming in. I'm like, these are all, you know, they're all kind of smaller deer. They're all baby tracks. And yeah. look at the bone on that. Oh, yeah, he's, he's... yeah. <laughs> Why does his ears? Yeah. Yeah. How long were you out here for? How did it go down? Well, I left at the house at like seven o'clock. Yeah. Uh, Charlie woke me up and I was like, well, I'll feed her and I'll just take my time. None of my hunting stuff's together. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's all dirty. He's got still got a load in it. <laughs> I get everything all situated and get all of her walked and just BS after BS. <laughs> I get out and I grab the gun. I was like, well, I'll do a test shot. And I film. Yeah. I get it on the, I put it on the, the, the phone on the processor. I shoot. And as soon as I shoot, I look over and it says, iPhone storage full. I'll delete that. Oh, I was in I was in 60 frames a minute, so I'll get rid of that. And it's like, man, that would have been great to put on, yeah. to put on the, the thing. Oh, yeah, on the video. Uh, I, was like, yeah, I was like, I'm going to shoot that birch right there. Pow! And I just spread a hole right in it. Nice. Then I got all my, <laughs> I deleted all my stuff on my phone. I was like, I yeah. don't need this, I don't need this, don't need this. I'm gonna need to film the deer. Yeah. <laughs> and I just get out and I was like, well, I'm just gonna go out for a couple hours and I'm gonna go shoot a deer. 
So then I <laughs> I start going through in the woods of here. It's like, well, they were here last year, and I'll see if I can find some tracks because there's a millions of these runways. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to get on a runway and go nice and easy. So right where the wood, there's some big pines over there. Oh, yeah. Right there, I just start filming. I was like, okay, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do the Joe Osgood, and I'm going to go chuck, chuck, chuck. I'm going to pretend there's a chain hooked between my feet. And I'm going to do a small little shuffle here, shuffle there, shuffle there. Yeah. And I'm just going to tip a can once in a while. Yep. Once in a while. I get there. I stop at this ma this little maple tree right here. And I hear, crunch, crunch. Oh, there's a deer. <laughs> so I go a little farther. And I see, I see him over there. It looks like a doe. And she's going this way. It looks like going this way. Oh, cool. So I, I go a little farther. And I get right where Tracy is standing. Yeah. And I in here, I somehow grunted i don't know how i did i grunted and which made it so he didn't come right in so he was right. like, oh, shoot there's a there's another buck with her <laughs> so i get where tracy is and i just tip a can and he's crunch 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 he walks over here crunch 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 walks over there he's like i don't want to get in there i want to go in but i don't want to go in and then uh I, there's a balsam fir right here. Yep. About the same distance on the back side, I look and here he comes to the woods. And he does this underneath the brush and I'm looking at him. I'm holding the phone underneath the underneath Under the, the gun. gun. I said, oh, it's a little buck. Perk. Yeah. <laughs> Ow, I saw that. I everywhere. Yeah. And then, of course, you see all that in film and everything. Dude, that's there. awesome. I was like, well, now I got to reload. Yeah. Reload and everything. <laughs> back over there and I got him in the neck right here. Yeah. And so he's... Oh, probably he's, just plop. He's still he, he's right on the ground. Yeah. Still kicking and stuff like that. So then uh, I reload, get over there, and he's doing this a little bit more, and I put it right here, and I just... Yep. Boom. Finish him off. No kidding. Yep. Dude, that's awesome. Yep. So was, and you're like, oh, it's a buck. Oh, it's a little buck. I'm, <laughs> like, I'm going to shoot him now. <laughs> <laughs> Today's the last day. Dude, I can't, I can't get over the rack on oh, yeah, that thing. Great little rack. Perfect dude, little look at the point. rack on that deer. <laughs> oh yeah, perfect little eight pointer. Dude, dude, that like, that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> it looks like you glued them on. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought it was a little tiny. I, I saw these right here, and I saw a little bit of that. I said, like, ah. Oh, it's about yeah. Close enough. <laughs> and you walk over, you're like, oh, oh nice. <laughs> dude, dad, dad's gonna freak out. <laughs> I love that. This is the biggest one this yeah. year. <laughs> <laughs> That's the biggest rack this year. It's like, look at that. On the, on probably the smallest deer. This doesn't make any sense oh, to me. Yeah. <laughs> that is so cool. Yeah. Yeah, it's perfect little buck. Yeah, he's such a nice one. Oh yeah. He had so much going on. This season he couldn't make it to camp, so this is a uh, well-deserved year. Congrats, buddy. Love you. That's awesome. Just like that. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> well. Back at Casey's house. We're gonna unload him. We gotta go do some errands and stuff, so we're gonna report him tonight. No pressure. Right here. Yep. All right. Take two. Oh, looks like it's over there. Yep. That does seem to be the place. All right. Okay, we made it. It's too late, guys. He's already dead. <laughs> they drove right by us. Yeah, they, they, they drove right we got, by. We got a report of a wounded deer. Oh, he was wounded. Oh, I, well, finished, he was. I finished him off. <laughs> Don't worry. All right, let's get this thing scaled up. What do we got, Case? It's a sixty-four point three kilograms. <laughs> 64 case, that's a lot lighter than <laughs> 800 pounds! Yeah. Oh, 600, that's not right. That's Newtons. We don't care about Newtons. You're in Newtons? That's start, yeah, we'll okay. start weighing them in Newtons. Okay. I shot. There we go. 142.1. 142.1. Yeah. Nice. That's what Beef said it was. Nice, Buck. 142, yeah. 
Thanks, guys. We really appreciate you uh, coming out with me on the last day. Yeah. <laughs> um, couldn't be happy with this little buck, and yeah. uh, I guess we'll see you on the next one. Be sure to like and subscribe. And we didn't have as much of a hoopla. The crowd was a little thin <laughs> on this one, but. Uh, yeah. Well, we got this guy. He's, yeah, cheer he's right. cheering us on. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> we had one person. So, well, guys, we'll see you in the next one. Take care. Say hi, you're on, you're on film. Hi. Hi, you. Hi. <laughs>